Hey, what's up, YouTube? It's Marvin again, back with some more music reactions. <laughs> Welcome back to Smitty Reacts. And on this video, we're gonna be doing something a little special, um, a little shorter video than I normally check out, but I gotta check it out. Um, I don't think I've ever actually reacted to Tool on this channel. That being said, I'm a Tool fan. Um, have been for many years. Um, Listen to a lot of their albums and songs and stuff like that over time. Um, so it's one of the bands, like, when people, like, ask me to check them out, I kind of try to avoid, just honestly, because I've heard a lot of their stuff. So it wouldn't necessarily be a true, genuine reaction. Now, that said, <laughs> that doesn't mean that I won't be checking out stuff from them. So, with that being said, I saw this video as I was white, kind of scrolling through YouTube here a little bit, looking for videos, and I saw one that Danny Carey of Tool, the drummer, the octopus himself, you know what I'm saying, was down at the Fog, which is the KU basketball court, um, at the Missouri versus KU game. Now, that being said, as a Kansas native, as a Topeka native, for those who don't know, you know what I'm saying, Lawrence is like 30 minutes from where I'm growing up from, 30 minutes from where I stay right now, it's 30 minutes either direction. But that Missouri versus KU rivalry, rivalry is legendary. You know what I'm saying, back to you know, back to the, the Civil War era stuff. So anyway, he was cool enough to show up to a KU show and perform a song with the band during that game, which from what I remember, I want to say KU won pretty soundly, if I remember right. <laughs> uh, but that said, somebody was cool enough to upload this video right here. So it's a shorter video. It's only like two minutes and some change, but I wanted to kind of see what Danny does here. Now, this is Danny Carey of Tool playing Fire at KU versus Missouri. I'm thinking Fire, like Fire? I don't I don't know what that is. So I'm, I'm kind of definitely wanting to check out and see what's going on here. <laughs> so for those of you that are new to the channel, please like, comment, share, subscribe, all that good stuff helps me uh, grow a little over here. And honestly, I'll say this, like I've listened to Tool before. I haven't listened to every damn Tool song ever. I, I will say that. So if you guys have stuff from Tool you want me to check out, um, Danny Carey drum videos, I like to do that over here too from time to time, check out drum videos and stuff. Um, I just uploaded a drum video a couple days ago. That was pretty fun. And uh, you know what? I'm here to check it out. So without too much more talking, let me go and jump right into this one. This is Danny Carey of Tool playing at the KU game. <laughs> Let's go. Uh oh, they're gonna warm it up. Hey, get that intro. I like that kill again. Okay. Oh, 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 okay. I'm sorry to pause right there. So, okay. So the Jimi Hendrix song, The Fire. Okay. Let me sing. I am not even going to try to sing that, but that was pretty cool. That's pretty cool, man. I, I, I appreciate the KU band right here, man, doing what they do. You know, uh, I don't know how efficient playing a clarinet through a mask really is, but obviously they're able to do it. So psh, more power to them anyway, <laughs> but this is cool. It's really cool to see him on the kit, just having fun with the band. We're going just a little bit, just so I can kind of check out some of the technique here and see what's going on. Let's go. About to knock that kid over. Okay, that roll was fire. No pun intended.
wrap it up. <laughs> oh, stick it up. <laughs> Yo, that was fire. That was fun right there, man. Oh, man. Give it up. Good up for Danny Terry from Tool. Now, I will say this. I also watched the news, and I saw a quick flash of that. Uh, I did see <laughs> that at KCI, I think a couple days after this, maybe the night after, whatever it was, Danny Terry was trying to find home. Uh and it looked like he got arrested following this performance. Uh, I don't know the details of the story. I just saw like the little uh, TMZ article or whatever that came out afterwards. And um, hopefully my guy is cool. Um, there is a video here below by Alec Tresner a couple days ago. So, hey, if you guys are familiar with Al I'm sorry, Alex Tresner, Alex Hefner, um, I appreciate his his reaction channels. I like his videos. Good morning to you, or good afternoon, or good night, whenever you're watching this. All I right. got this piggy hat, found it in my bag. Uh, my buddy Kobe. Pause there for a second. If you're not familiar with my guy's channel right here, um, he's an awesome reactor. I watch his reactions darn near all the time, you know, in between my stuff or whatever, just to kind of like see what the community's up to and so forth. He's one. Um, I got a list of reactors that I subscribe to on my own. Uh, so if you guys aren't subscribed to his channel, not that he needs my plug or anything. He don't know me from Adam, but, you know, go ahead and check his channel out. But look at this. Danny Carey arrested for assault. Oh, is that what he got arrested for? Let's see. Adds a little extra element to the story that makes it a little bit better for some weird reason. Kind of funny because in the video you can actually hear Danny say he's the drummer for Tool and the cops don't give a shit. It's like, do you not know that this man can assault you in polyrhythms? What the hell is even that? Now, honestly, out of all the people to get punched by, I mean... Danny Carey would, I'm not going to say that it would be an honor to get punched by Danny Carey, but oh, that would wow. be a, a pretty awesome story. Pause right there. That would be kind of fun, man. If you get punched by Danny Carey from Tool, you know what I'm saying? Like out of anybody here. I'm, I'm not going to play the entire video. I'm going to skip around a little bit. Uh, but let me see. Let me see what is the action. Really? Hey. Hey. Dang. It's so stupid, dude. This is the stupidest thing I ever seen. For what though? <laughs> Danny Carey looks like a little jailbird, let's be honest. I mean, okay, let's look at the facts, right? Danny Carey's obviously drunk and disorderly in public. Is it that big of a deal? I think, I mean, the homophobic slur, if that's true, it's fucked up, right? But, I mean, oh, poking somebody in the chest like this, I don't know what happened. And what it sounds like to me is probably misdemeanor assault. I mean, worst case scenario, right. dude's looking at something like 30 days in jail, pays 500 bucks, something like that. Now, if they bump it up to a felony assault or... I, I doubt that we get that far, like, depending on how bad it was or whatever happened. At the same time, you got to take the law seriously. If you're traveling between places or whatever, it is what it is. You know what I'm saying? Like, up at KCI or any airport for that matter, doesn't matter what city you're in. If you bust the law at an airport, they're going to come down hard on you for the most part. Like, it is what it is. So you got to be you gotta be on your P's and Q's at all time, especially when you got, like, you know, something to lose like that, whatever. Now, I'm not really big on him as a – like. I say big as far as like, I don't have a lot of knowledge about him as a person or anything, but I did read some comments here and there that I guess he may be kind of known for stuff like this. I don't know if that's true or false. You know, it's all alleged accusations and all that good stuff. But here, let me let me slide through a little bit. Harry <laughs> arrested for poking someone. Okay, we're done. I mean, I mean, he didn't swing at nobody or from what I understand, you know, like, I guess assault is assault. It is what it is. So, and anyway, hey y'all. I'm going to put the link to Alex's channel over here. Um, that way you have it. As well as the link to the original video I checked out here too. Uh, down in the comment section below. This is how I'd like to remember him. That's how I'd like to remember Danny, honestly. This big smile on his face. Kicking it to KU game. Having fun, you know. He must be a friend of the director. Or, or maybe he contributes to the school. I don't know. 
I don't know how these things happen. Maybe they just cut him a check and said, hey, bro, come and show up. <laughs> you know, but it's really cool of him to show up either way. Uh, that said, who knows if he'll ever be back. You know, but at least we had this moment. I, I thought it was pretty cool. Uh, so, yeah, <laughs> that said, man, if you want me to check out some more stuff from Tool, more from Danny, if there's anything from this situation you guys want me to know about or what the um, current status of what's going on is, let me know about it. I'll drop, those, I'll drop the information down in the comment thread below, man. I appreciate all that good stuff, man. So, at any rate, hey, my name is Marvin, Smitty Reacts. Thanks for watching the channel with me. And uh, until the next video, take care of yourself. Be kind to one another. And uh, you guys can do that. I'll catch you in the next video. All right? All right. Peace.